What's up, you guys? Nico here, and today I am back with some more Miss Marvel. This is Season 1, Episode 5, Time and Again. It's a really short episode today. If you want to watch the full-length versions of all my reactions, as well as other reactions and other things, feel free to check out my Patreon. If you want to watch me live stream, check out my Twitch. If you want to chat with me, check out Discord. You can also follow me on a bunch of other places. I post on TikTok a lot these days. If there's social media, I'm on it. So <laughs> all of that will be linked down below. And here we go. Booking it. We're booking it, boys. Barefoot? That doesn't seem fun. Nice. Is that the grandmother? Or the great grandmother? Ooh, we didn't get an English version. Interesting. Why are we sleeping in a field? He's got a very nice beard. I'm glad they switched to English. My brain is struggling to read at the moment. <laughs> so I'm surprised I didn't have to rewind it to read the opening bit there because I, I was not able to read it for a second. Focus is difficult, huh? especially with a headache. I don't know what she's eating, but I want to try it. This is supposed to be a love story that's brewing because I'm not feeling any... Hey, that's who I figured we were looking at. She looked like the picture, so the drawing that the grandmother did. It's gorgeous to look at, but so far I'm kind of bored, so. So is Aisha, is she one of the celestial peoples that tried to attack Mala? Or does she just have the bangle? I don't remember. <laughs> Who's she see? Is it, what's her name? Yep. That was kind of creepy, but okay. Are they burning the fields on purpose? Or are the fields just being burned? Tell me the truth. No child in that blanket. Make sure Sana gets on that train tonight. Promise me, Hassan. Nothing is going to happen. It's not a promise, but okay. Good way to avoid making a promise, but... I'll find it if it's the last thing I do. Rude. Is, um... Kamala supposed to be here? Because that's what the end... That how the last episode ended. Was with Kamala here. Is this supposed to feel intense? We already know what happens here. Oh, so Aisha sort of summoned Kamala. Is that what's happening? It's not her. It's you, you bitch. True. She ain't wrong. And R.I.P. I'm honestly really surprised that the grandmother's painting of her is so accurate, considering how young she was when she last saw her. Can't do stars, Nanny, but I can do circles, okay? <laughs> it was me. Shocker. <laughs> I don't feel like we needed 30 minutes to tell us that, but, but all right. I love all the people on top of the train. Time to go back. Magnum got lost once. I had him microchipped. Okay, Ami, <laughs> Magnum is a dog. Kamala is a girl. Okay? Do, 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 I wonder, dog. okay, if she remembers her mother's face, why wouldn't she remember Kamala's face? I mean, granted, she didn't spend as much time with Kamala, obviously, but like, it would make sense, wouldn't it? If it was legal, I would do it. <laughs> if it was legal, I would do it. Okay. Like spyware for parents? Kind of. Then why am I only just hearing about this? <laughs> we can go home. Then hurry the fuck up about it. Jesus Christ. Maybe not. I can make it. I mean, sure, if you want to. She doesn't care about him. Left him behind. Am I supposed to care? All I ever wanted was to be with her family, and you took that from her. How did how does she know that Kamala didn't see her stab her? Did, did do we already have that information? Is that information I've forgotten? Because all the things we saw in the episode, she wasn't Kamala wasn't present for. Is is Kamala already aware of the fact that she killed Aisha? Did she tell her that? And I forgot. Let me know. <laughs> Why do you care? Calm. What? I'm very confused. Who is that? <laughs> Hello? 
<laughs> oh, she has a picture of her now. <gasps> she have a she has a picture of Aisha now. She said she didn't have one before. Nice. She'd be really proud of you. The guy we met once, yeah, I'm sure he would be. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Well, I don't know how much more trouble I can get into after all this. Just in case. Well, we've got a whole episode left, so I'm sure there's something. It's Kamala's. It broke. <laughs> it's the, it's the symbol on her suit. <laughs> I'm so bored. This episode felt so unnecessary. <sighs> Almost at the end. Is a uh, Kamran gonna find him? Behind the dumpster. Yeah. Is there a call guy as well? Sure, just blow up his entire livelihood. <laughs> that was the most pointless episode so far. We didn't need any of the backstory, but that's fine. <laughs> At least it was short. <laughs> I have too many complaints about these shows. They've just... This didn't need to be an episode on its own. It really didn't need to be... I don't know if this just isn't hitting for me. Like, are there other people out there that are genuinely full-on enjoying this? Or am I, like, burnt out on these shows? Like, I'm really curious if anyone else is feeling the same level of I don't fucking care about some of these shows as I am. Because I've talked to a few people that, like, show up in my live streams and stuff about how the pacing in all these shows are pretty shit in all of the Disney Plus Marvel shows. They're all pretty lacking in terms of good pacing. This show is no exception to that rule. If anything, it's the best example of that because we got no new important information in this episode other than the mom celestial chick dying and Kamran getting powers and the blowing up of the shop, all of which happened in the last 10 minutes of the episode. We did not need to know that Kamala went back in time. We didn't need, I mean, I guess it was important for her mom to find out she was the one with the powers, but I feel like they could have worked that in a bit better. The first half of this episode was completely pointless. Like, I, I feel like Aisha would have been cooler as more of like a mythical, like, person that we don't really know what happened to her. Is this comic driven? Is that why we got all this stuff? Let me know. I don't know the comics, so maybe this is to fulfill some comic book quota or something. I don't know, but I'm really bored and I'm really happy there's only one episode left because I really could not care less about this show right now. <laughs> I feel so bad about it because I wanted to enjoy these shows. I really wanted to enjoy them. I wanted to enjoy Moon Knight. I wanted to enjoy this show. I wanted to enjoy all of them and I've not enjoyed the majority of them. I'm just happy it was only 30 minutes long. If it would have been a full 50 minute episode, I might have, I might have had to stop in the middle. <laughs> well, that was Miss Marvel season one episode five time and again. I believe there's only one episode left and I will see you all for that one when I see you all for that one. And until then, you do you. Bye-bye.